Hey everyone, I'm Nog and welcome back to Factorio. In the last episode, we got uh, some iron going up here and I had forgotten to set up some defense, so I set up a bit. I didn't have enough ammo for all the turrets, but uh, some of them do have ammo and that's good because I already got attacked right here. So we do have a bit of ammo there, and I guess they're coming from this base out here. That's the only where place I can see that they would be coming from. Maybe down here, but wouldn't they go over here? I would think so. Yeah, but we do have a bit of defense up here. And everything is working fine. So that's good. We also completed our laser turret. Uh, Research, so let's get some more research going. And we will research. Uh, worker robot speed two. Because we need fast worker robots, right? And today's objective is to get started on our uh, mall, finally. And it's going to be over here. So let's just delete this stuff. We will need that to come up, so I'm not going to delete, delete all of it. Uh, all right, and this chest is completely full, uh, which is a good thing. Uh, though it would be nice that it was not right where it is. But uh, yeah, we'll manage. Okay, so our mall is going to be out here. We're getting close to our defensive line so what we're going to have to do at some point is go and clear out all of this stuff and hopefully uh, this ends here and this ends here so we can clear out the whole thing and just have to worry about defenses in this in this direction that would be really really nice uh, but we'll see we will see okay so mall what do we want to do? Oh, I'm thinking that anything that only needs iron, we will do first, and then anything that needs iron and green circuits, and then anything that needs anything else. So let's do that. And the first thing that I can think of that just needs iron is pipes. So let's do pipes first. Uh, transport belts just need iron as well. Not the uh, splitter ones, but we will have to do them together with that anyway. And what else just needs iron? Nothing, I guess. Yeah, basically nothing else just needs iron. Don't need barrels. So yeah, how many? We do have some machines. So let's give ourselves a bit of space and start building right here, maybe. Seems reasonable to me. So this will be pipes, and this will be pipes ground. And then we will need a transport belt, which also need gears. We're going to have to move this chest. Let's build one over here and just uh, empty this out. So we will get iron going right here and coming up here. And we need there, there, there. 
And then we need somewhere to output it, which will be over here. Into chests. And I'll just be regular chests. We'll upgrade them to uh, uh, some of these chests later on. But that's about it for that. Then we need iron gear wheels. You know what? Let's just take all of this stuff out. We don't know where it's going to be anyway right now. So no point in having it. All right. There we go. So iron gear wheels. I have forgotten to put iron gear wheels all the way. Luckily, they are not that far away. Uh, but let's. Uh, ooh, we have a lot of iron ore on us. Let's just build a chest here and stick everything in that we don't want on us at this time. Fine to have the rails. I don't care about that. We don't want that. We don't want our pistol. Stupid. Uh, we actually have a lot of them. <laughs> because we've died a few times. But don't tell anyone. Uh, Alright, that's it. Oh, there was something else. These guys we will never need again. Hopefully. Okay, so worker robot speed. Uh, let's do... Let's do uranium processing. Alright. Let's grab some stuff from over here so that we have on us what we need. Uh, we will need some slow ones as, as well. We have that. We have some uh, long-handed. Uh, we will need some assembling machines, lights. I think we have. Uh, let's grab a bit of ammo as well. Uh, let's just grab one stack for ourselves for now. Right, so I think we're set with everything we need right now. Let's get back over here. And get everything set up. We won't uh, complete them all this uh, this time, but uh, or in this episode, but we will complete it uh, eventually. So we need like that. This all we can. Let's just do that then. And get it going. Set up the undergroundies. And here we are. End of the line for now. Right, and we need to get them going up. Let's do that there. And just continue up like that. And put a long handed inserter in. And this needs to go into both that and that and that. So let's see, how did we do it over here at the other one? Uh, that works, but it was a bit messy, I think. I think it was a bit messy. Hmm. Yeah, a bit too messy for my liking. So what we'll do is we will stick these on belts. And we'll build like that, I guess. Actually, we can build like this. And then this will be... 
fast transport belt. And that will be the uh, faster transport belt. Yes. And then we will have and uh, you know what let's just let's not let's do like this and we will have fast transport belt here then we'll have the ultra fast then we'll have uh, undergroundies fast undergroundies ultra fast undergroundies And then we will have the splitters, fast splitters, and the ultra fast splitters. And that will be one side of our uh, what's it called? Our thing, our mall is what it's called. So we will need to get this going up here, I guess. And we will need to get this going up here. And we will need green circuits as well. So we'll figure that out in a bit. But these will definitely come out onto here. And then you will pick them up, and you will pick them up, and you will pick them up. Um, let's get some power going so that we can see that everything is working, shall we? Uh, and hook it up here. And that stuff's working. Uh, don't you need? Oh, you have. Just need a one of those. And then we need an output chest for you. So what we'll do there is we will stick it right here, and we will go underground here. And pick you in there. Right, those are producing. Let's see, do these need... No, do these need... No. Alright. Good, good. So, then there's you. You need iron plate as well. So we'll give you that. And again, we'll go underground, underground, and have a, oh, what are they destroying? We, here, we need to go give them some ammo, I think. Hopefully, they're not destroying more than that one. Um, that would be bad. We'll put a light on every power pole here I think because it's where somewhere that we'll probably be spending quite a bit of time so it's nice to have a lot of a lot of lights so there we go and what were we doing we were setting this up we need an output no you don't my bad we need to go up there so we don't actually need to go underground right there but we do need to go underground for this one and what do you need you will just need some of these and then we'll go underground for the output so and i'm not this is probably or well it's most definitely not the most sexy mall in the world, but uh, it works, and that's what matters to me. Well, for now it works anyway. 
Uh, so far. So far it works. Now let's do five. Five. You need power right there. We'll give you some power right there. So now this can start producing, okay? Then there's this thing. It does need iron plate. And it needs the uh, green circuits. And so does this. And it also needs e wheels. Just turn that up. Turn that out. Insert of there. So now all it needs is electronic circuits. That doesn't need to go any further than that, I think. So let's get some electronic circuits going. How do we want to do that? I guess we'll bring them up on the other side. Uh, so that would be here. We'll have electronic circuits. And I think we'll let them go on both sides and we'll use that for uh, that line for the next uh, section of the mall as well. So let's see, we need a splitter here. You need to go underground. And so do you from up here. There we go. And we'll get this going. Bring that there and that there. And we need an output. So stick that there and there. All right. And limit you to two stacks as well. Okay. So that's the first part of the mall going. And we've left room for the other, uh, the higher level uh, belts as well. So that's good. Then we need over here, we do need inserters. So the first one is going to be the burner inserter. We'll automate all of it. So we have the burner inserter. Let's see how many. One, two, three, seven. Mm, seven so far. Are there more? I don't remember. Are there like long-handed? stack inserters and long-handed filter inserters and stuff like that i don't remember hmm what would it be under if there is uh, don't really see anything that Think it would be under well, I guess not so I guess there are seven inserters okay uh, what what research do we want to do nuclear power that oh that's gonna take a while actually let's just leave the research for now Okay, so we have, you can bring one line up here, 
and then we can bring a line up here. They do need an output space as well, uh, but we'll just do the underground thing as well again. So you will be burner inserter. Four, five, six, seven. Yes. One, two, five, six, seven. Right. So let's bring up these lines. And get some stuff going on them. I guess we'll get the iron going here. And we'll get. I think we'll take from right here. Um, that won't work. We'll need this here. The other end will come out there. And around with this thing. And there we go. Okay. So burner inserter, inserter. Uh, Long-handed inserter, fast inserter, filter inserter, stack inserter, back filter inserter. Okay. So this one just needs some of this and some of this, and then it needs an output like so. need to make some more chests let's limit this to one stack and that's that uh, let's do power again and lights there we go so we're making those now uh, these we need to make there, 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 and we're actually going to need two outputs for this because this goes into these guys and these guys. So we'll do a underground there. To there, pick a chest, limit it to two stacks, and then we'll do belt over here. Up here, do long handed. And then we will feed it into here, and this needs. Uh, those, those, and those. And then we can do underground from there to there. We can a chest and start filling it up. Stacks. And this one needs. Iron plate, uh, oh, we don't need those, there, there, and need these as well, there, so that's producing, go so underground, from there to there, chest, can we make more? Let's do that. And stick it in there. But we do actually need... This is going to be a problem. 
Where is it? Does this need fast inserters? Does this need fast inserters? Yes, it does. Does this need fast inserters? No, it needs stack inserters. Okay. So what I guess we'll do is we'll do like this. We'll again limit this to two stacks. All right. And this needs power. So those are coming out there. And you need electronic circuits. And fast inserters, and that's it. Yes. Okay. Oh, this one needs advanced circuits as well. But we don't need iron to go any further, it seems like. So let's not do that. So that means that we don't need this underground here. We can just do like that and be happy about that. So this is making filter inserters. We just need an output for that. Let's give it an output and limit it to two stacks. Don't really need two stacks of that, but uh, it's fine. And this needs to come in, or we'll run the red circuits up and onto this. I think that might be what we will do. Yeah. It's just this one thing that needs them. Where are our red circuits? They're all the way down here. Um, let's uh, do like that, and then we can run this down and get some red circuits going. Something's wrong here. Ah, no. Uh, I need to split you out. And you to go underground. And you to come up here. I think that's right. We actually don't need to have two sides going at all. Then you can come down this way and this thing actually needs four inputs. Okay, uh, we need that and that and that, and then you need an output. We will put right there. So that's stack inserters, and then it's just these, you know what, we'll just do like this, and like that, and give you an output. There we go. And with that, and with that, yes we did. All right. This just needs to be one stack. So let's do that. This just needs to be one stack as well. So let's do that. All right. So we have belts and inserters automated now. There's a lot more that we need automated. And like I said, this is not the prettiest mall in the world, but it's a functional mall. So that's uh, and that's fine by me. I don't really need it to be pretty. 
we can do pretty when everything is working. So, uh, but that's uh, all we have time for in this episode, guys. So, uh, thank you very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, why not leave a like and maybe subscribe. And I will see you next time.